And the sixth question, what do you think about neuro-linguistic programming and its impact slash ethics? My reply is, I think the ethical value of NLP and its social impact are inversely proportional. The bigger it gets as a phenomenon, the worse and more evil it becomes. It may be argued from within the realm of fiction. One person using NLP to swindle another is just an old Jedi mind trick, which is arguably bad enough. But one person using NLP to swindle a whole vast audience is Emperor Palpatine, a.k.a. Darth Sidious, which is obviously meant to be seen as being far worse. Of course, fiction pales by comparison to reality. In truth, such Hitlerian psychological persuasion of the masses, and that by any means necessary, including illegal use of subliminal messaging, and even up to practicing outright magic, well beyond just the use of NLP alone, has been the mission statement of the entire corporate class since Edward Bernays invented advertising and named it propaganda in 1928 AD. What mass media and institutional education indoctrinate us to desire is merely a misdirection, distracting our attention away from those others who flank us and rob us of our freedom to escape, thus tricking us into doing work for them usually in exchange for fake money. Most modern people, almost everyone in the industrialized, almost everyone in the industrially developed nations of Western civilization are debt slaves in this social mechanism. Call this system fascism, extremist capitalism, or Sovietism, extremist socialism. It is a result of competition between free market trade and statism that has been going on since the beginning of the earliest Sumerian Empire, unifying multiple city-state polities at least 4,000 years ago. Many would say, without persuasion, where would we be? It is simply one person leading others that has gotten us where we are today. And to this, I would reply, exactly. Again, NLP is just one of those things that I can imagine a world without it in, which I would consider a better world than our own today. Sadly, the reality is NLP is increasingly prominent, ever more persuasive, ever more pervasive and problematically persuasive in modern society. People have been subjected to a nonstop bombardment of poisons and ads for almost a century by now, and we have grown quite stupid as a result of it. In the type of society we live in, defined by dupes and liars, it is unsafe to trust anyone. This is certainly not an ideal utopia. <laughs> 